Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to part 76 of Let's Play Albert Odyssey. Still fighting Krishna. Still poisoned. At this point, I'm I'm tired of dealing with her. The problem is, I don't think poison will wear off on its own. Right, I need to cure Pike because he's probably not going to get too much off this. Yeah, we need to heal Pike. Which at this point is basically just trading HP from Kia to Pike, because she's going to lose HP because of healing him. Not nearly as much as Pike lost, though. Pike, kill her. Go get her. On the upside, we can only have one... What the hell? Oh, she can use Vortex, like I can. That's gonna hurt a little bit. Oh my god, did that hurt. Maybe I should have Aka cast Silence on her. The only thing is I'm not really confident enough that it'll stick. But as I was saying, on the upside, uh, we can only really have one status effect at a time. So if she uses what's-its-face attack again, Vlag's Domain, It'll either not have an effect, because we already have a status effect going on, or it'll overwrite it. Yeah. And this is another one of these battles that I'm sitting here saying, this is kind of redundant, that you can put a status effect on all of my people instantly, and there's not a fast enough way to cure it. Oh, damn it. This is gonna hurt. Ooh. All right. Pike. I'm gonna have to start using some of these items that I've got. Healing breath. I wish there was some way to give everyone like an infusion of dragon man blood so they don't get status effects. Alright. Aka's probably dead. Oh no, she's not. That's amazing. Amon's close to dead at this point. There we go. At this point, Ki is about dead, so I'm... I don't want her to die because she'll lose out on the massive amount of XP that we're going to get from this fight like we got from the Balan fight. but her usefulness is running out quickly. And she's dead. But on the upside, I can have either Aka or Pike cast Resurrect on her. She'll come back to life with full HP and no status effect. And it'll be... Yeah. 
Pike's about dead. This fight went from bad to worse real fast. Sadly, I kind of wish everyone didn't die, <laughs> so I could bring them back without any status effects. Pike's probably dead, but... Oh well. Yeah, Pike's dead. That was kind of a waste of an item. I should have used it on Kia. Or Egg, excuse me. Holy crap, Pike's not dead. Should probably cast Quickster on Grizz, because he needs to act faster. I don't feel like I'm getting enough healing breaths in. Um, you need it. Healing breath all around. But on the upside, I only have two poisoned people now. If I could just get the healing back up under control, I could go back to doing damage. Which I think I could slowly do. Because she seems to be focused more on Vortex now than anything. And again, I should, probably should have used Quick Stir. Why did I not do that? Yeah. I guess I only hope that she'll die. Oh. This is gonna hurt Eamon. But at this point, I don't care. If he dies, I'll just resurrect him with one of my two resurrectors, and that'll be fine. Healing breath. That'll help out a little bit. The next vortex aim is probably dead. That's the easiest way to deal with this fight, though. No, Eamon's not dead. He's limping along still. I'm gonna have him go out in a blaze of glory and just attack her and then die. No, he's gonna heal Pike, is what he's gonna do. And then when I finish this tower, I'm gonna sell all of these weapons and items that I don't need. I'm gonna buy a ton more healing items. Not that I should really need them at this stage. And it is getting a little ridiculous. Yeah, heal Pike. Okay, fine. Kill Eamon. I'm, I'm fine with that. Alright, um, I will go ahead and end the video here, and I will see you all in our next installment, in which I resurrect Eamon and then actually hopefully do something useful. Later, everyone.